Hello, and welcome to my garden. This is one of my friendly chickens down here called Goldie. She loves it when I'm digging and weeding because she finds lots of little insects and worms to eat, don't you Goldie? And we've got Tom, I think Tom, one of my cats is over there. Oh yeah, look, sitting on the seat. I expect some of you have pets as well. Yeah, we've spent a lot of time in our gardens recently, haven't we, due to this lockdown. We miss our friends, don't we? I miss going out. I miss going round the shops. Because I, I like buying something new. I like getting a bargain. Because it's always nice to have something new, isn't it? Whether it's new clothes, new toys, or games for the Switch, or new makeup. Do you know, Jesus once told his friends that he was giving them a new commandment. Love one another. Well, that's not too difficult if we're talking about our friends and people we like and get on with. But how do we love someone that's nasty to us and we don't like? That's a bit more difficult. When we look at the news and see what's been happening recently, we realise we need to love one another. We need to find ways of living in harmony with each other and be kind to each other. Jesus asks us to do something. He doesn't leave us to cope on our own. He's always there to help us. It's like having a bestest, bestest friend. We can talk to him about anything. I believe that the commandment of Jesus to love one another is as new and relevant today as it was 2,000 years ago when Jesus lived. And I think it will still be as relevant in 2,000 years time if planet Earth is still around. <laughs>